Eyes, with some LED headlights and our flight on the side, creating a nice visceral stance, as you would expect from an off-road vehicle. Down here, you've got some fog lights. Nothing special, not something you would expect on an off-road vehicle. But these fog lights are removable. You can actually take these fog lights out and use them down the beaten path or even attach them to your bike. And of course, a bike is very important to all off-roaders, so that's why the FTAC has a built-in bike rack. You, all you gotta do is slide the bike rack out from under the vehicle, get your bike on, and it is safely and secured to your vehicle. Back in the front here, you've got these little hooks. Those are recovery hooks. Really convenient. Let's say if these off-road adventures get a little too intense and your car gets stuck, well, another vehicle can come over here and pull the car out. We've also got skip plates in the front and the back to prevent all that debris from coming out of your car, protecting your engine, and also making it more comfortable as well. Now, all off-road adventures require cargo, lots and lots of cargo. So that's why we have what's called a safari-style cargo roof rack up in the top. You can't see it, but there's a bit of a divot down there to allow you to prevent the cargo from sort of slipping around in the roof and keeping it nice and secure. You've also got ambient lighting in there. So what happens at night when you're securing atoms? Well, you can turn on the ambient lighting and you can see everything that you're doing from the top over here, the roof. We've also got lights back over here on the back visor. Really awesome for unloading and loading as well. But also, you can control all these lights from your phone. So let's say you're sitting by the campfire and you need a little more lights. Well, just pull out your phone, get the app, and you can turn on that very same light to illuminate your entire campsite. Now, these two lights in the front are actually my favorites. Great lights used for illuminating the path in front of you, but they're also flashlights. Flashlights in the sense that are built for cameras. They actually produce a flash. Why? Well, you've got two cameras built on each side mirror of the FTAC, and the cameras can take photos, live stream, and even video. And let's say your adventure stops on the road and you want to keep going down a path, you can actually remove these cameras and take it with you and even attach it to your bike. And once you've taken all the photos and videos, it makes your heart content of your adventure.